this fight goes on and finally get the victory against Libya. We thought it was never going to come. We thought say this the the goal will come um, after all. This period, that waiting period, that trial period, how you been taking the feel? My brother, you know easy. As you know even easy at all. This kind of thing happened uh, to all this North African team. Eh? They want to do you dirty. They want to get uh, the result any way possible. Anyhow. You can now uh, you can see the tactics, uh, the way they, they play, yeah, the way the keeper is falling down, the way the defense, uh, the, the way they defend. Kuruso, our coach, he knows what's all okay. Uh, we need to get something out of this game. So he make the substitution as soon as possible. You can see he removed the Franco Yeka, he removed the DD2, he put on Chikweze, Dele Bazuri, Wobia and everything. So uh, kudos to the boys. They get the win at the end, at the end of the day. And 1-0, 7 points, I think. With That's this thing, enough. yeah, yeah, we, we should qualify. Uh, we should qualify to the half corner next year. Oh, all right. Uh, that, po that moment when that goal came, nobody expected it. That moment. What, how, how did you celebrate? How was your... How was your reaction? My brother, I cannot lie to you. Uh, the guy that was sitting with me, I was like, I didn't even uh, want to celebrate the goal because the match was so frustrated. But it is what it is when the goal he already bought it at the back of the net. I was so happy. I was so excited. At the end of the day, we get the goal and we get the three, three points. points. That's, just that's, that's the most important thing. But my ask you, were you disappointed in Victor Boniface's performance? Boniface, how far now? Three starts, no goal. Nigeria, I know they get pressure like this. So, we they go just come out to you. We don't tire now. We get other strikers to do this business for us. I feel the, the problem for Boniface is he doesn't know how to position himself in the box. When you say you'll be striker, you don't, we don't want you to deal with anybody. We don't want you to, there's nothing you want to do outside. This is where you will score for us. Position yourself in the right place. He doesn't, he's not there when he's supposed to be there. That's the problem he's having. We, uh, our left back, uh, Bruno, he crossed like two or three times. But if it's good, this guy, uh, uh, Moses Simon, he dribble, dribble, cross. Boniface no day. You can see our goal. The late run from the midfield is the is the late run for the mid. Now waiting make us score that goal. But Boniface needs to work on his finishing and his positioning. Make him leave all those Nima when he go to watch in YouTube and uh, uh, Casola and Robinho when he go to watch in YouTube. Make go to watch go score. Make go to make go to watch on Instagram. Make go to watch Ronaldo. Now your stats go make you big striker. Forget about how they say. You see, Copa always said they give him best player in England. Wait to make people then give him because of the goal. Now you need to be there at the right time. Now improving, now you go be there. Nigeria, we know they get pressure like that. Three stats, you don't score for us. You go to hear people to shout now. All those, all, all those kind of things. The way you don't touch the shot already. I don't. Yes, yes, now. Don't be only me to complain. Everybody complain now. Everybody complain now. Hey now, you're not, you're not getting. Yeah, I feel so excited because at first there was still more tension, and the Libya players were trying to get, um, trying to scare their players while they were falling, and it was so annoying. At least seeing them score one goal is very more improvement. At least they have gained a point, and now the Libya can now. Yes, they can fall as they want many times as they want. Where that go? Where that go? Be Elta. Don't talk to you. What do you do? I was shouting. I nearly jumped. Well, uh, well, I go there. I go there. Talk about Victor Boniface for this game. Honestly, Victor Boniface for performance is very, very poor. Unlike his team, when he used to play for his club, I don't, I, and his body language here shows that he wasn't even ready for the game. I well, was so excited today, and I believe that Nigeria will win this ball. That's what I believe. And if like, I came here late, all is gone out. I, from my house, I come here. I, I know, really know that Nigeria will win this match. Okay. But what, what is my expectation? It's like I expect Nigeria to have like three goals. That's my expectation. Why not rich? Yeah, yeah. So, uh, when, when the match we don't go uh, far, almost 80 minutes and all of them, people never come. I did not lose goals. You not lose goals. I believe that they will. You be well, you be the wave this summer, Fla. Yes, you yes. be the wave. Yes. <laughs> when the Nigeria don't lose, I go. If the Nigeria lose this match, they go. They go. They will. They will not win. There's no how when Nigeria will not win. But then about I believe, even though, even though I, believe, I believe, even though my spirit, yeah. I know Nigeria will win. Okay, tell me about Victor Boniface. You, you they happy with with the performance? I they happy with all of them. Okay, they okay. are performing well. Right. They are doing well. Right. Even the ball control, the shooting ball, everything was nice. Yeah. I like the way they are playing. All right.
well, I feel so good because we won and we went home with the three points. Even though I wanted more goals, so that in case we go to their home, it will be it will, the advantage will be still yeah. more. But I guess Nigeria will do well in the next game. In the next, in the next game, I also wanted Boniface, Mister Boniface, to score. Because, but I guess the defense was more on him. That's why the wings were free for them to be crossing him. So yeah, that's nice. All right. So you say you just love Victor, Victor Boniface. I wanted him to score. He didn't score in this particular encounter. That's making it how many going, how many consecutive games that he hasn't scored. Has it dropped that hope for you? Has it dropped that expectations for you? Do you think he's still the man that can replace Victor Osimhen? No, uh, uh, he has not. He has not dropped my host. I still believe in him. I still believe in him. I still like him. But in me comparing him with Omi Simen, no, 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 no. they are both Nigerians, so I can't compare them together. Both of them are still the goat of Nigerians. All right, thank you so much. Yeah, yeah. yeah very. I thank God for this, this, this very day because this is the first time I saw this. I was so common, but I just expect that I'll come. I will come just come and waste my time, but. Thank God for God. I'm happy. I'm, God happy. God. I'm happy for Nigeria. <laughs> for the first time. <laughs> so I'm very happy. Very okay. happy. So when, when the match will start there, eh, come like say the goal they come at all at all. All the effort just they waste and everything. I will take you for that moment. Eh, already I'm like, I was not early come. Mm. But I just come and see you are doing something mm. much better. Eh. Eh. When Nigeria is going to use this thing. Why? Wow, I blew this thing. I I think I think I I know what I think is. The Mediterranean Knights of Libya as the final to have a feel of the top uh, before uh, they will get ready for their warm up. They are put on all over the group. They drew their first game at home and lost away from home. And now on match day three, Libya is here to take on the Super Eagles of Nigeria. Let's give them a warm welcome, ladies and gentlemen.